How are you guys? Welcome to Audrey's reading area. Yes, fun day Monday. It is fun day Monday. So shout out to my grandbabies, Korea, Sana, David III, and Kaden. Love you all and I miss you so much. All right, all right, all right, you guys. Alexa, what time is Audrey's reading area? Audrey reads in her area live at five and please subscribe. L. I V E live at five. And won't you subscribe? You all click like and share. Share my videos, then go to YouTube, look for Audrey's reading area. Mm-hmm. Smash that subscribe button for me. All right, all right, all right. Now. So on this fun day Monday, I have another another fun and exciting book that I'll be reading to you. I know you you know the theme by now, right? If I ran your school, like I do my classroom, right? If I ran your school by the cat in the hat, of course it's Dr. Seuss, Dr. Seuss book. It says, look at the first page, I love it. <laughs> Looks like notebook paper, loose leaf paper. Old school people say loose leaf paper. Kids these days say notebook paper or line paper. <laughs> If I ran your school by the cat in the hat with a little help from Alastair Heim, illustrated by Tom Brannon. And this is a beginner book. Yes. Yes. So I'm going to jump right in and read. So check it out. Check it out. I just heard a thing. So I came right away. The king of all unfunny things. I might, I must say. I heard that you two, or perhaps maybe you, think going to school is a dull thing to do. I came here to show you that school can be fun. I showed up to show you how school fun is done. If I ran your school, we would start every day in a pledge fully way as we stand up and say. Today I will learn how much fun fun can be. From eight after eight until three after three, I will smile all the while with a grin on my chin till the, day, till the end of the day from the time we begin. Loving it. <clears throat> if I ran your school, we would get a class pet, but not just one pet, all the pets we can get. I'll put on my glasses. All the pets we can get. I know these things make me look a little old, right? <laughs> Let me put them behind my ears. There you go. Some would be fuzzy and some would be wet and others would come as a two for one set. If I ran your school, I would help you to read by giving each student a book blooming seed. Each seed would be planted and grow in a pot and after we water and water a lot. Dr. Seuss is known for his rhyming words, so yes, they just flow. The seeds would sprout books that would fill up the room. The more that you read them, the more you would bloom. Nice. If I ran your school, I would give a pop quiz where we take... <clears throat> Where we take and we shake every bottle there is until they explode into fountains of fizz. And if you can guess how much fizz that there is, it truly would make you a pop fizz wit quiz whiz. A pop fizz quiz whiz. 
<laughs> Just know, sometimes I do get tongue-tied while saying all of these rhyming words. If I ran your school on the days you have art, I would drive all around in my art-making cart. Look at that art-making cart. Isn't that cool? Look at that. So cool. My cart to make art. His cart to make art. That's so cool. Would have glitter and glue and lots of fun things that are perfect for you. Aw. Lovely, isn't it? At 12 after 12, we would serve a buffet of pizzas and pancakes and tray after tray of berries and cherries and swirly sorbet to keep you well fed for the rest of the day. Guess that was sorbet <laughs> to rhyme with day. Aw, I'm loving it. If I ran your school, we would cover your sneakers in double bounce bubbles we brew in these beakers to give your old sneakers a little more pep. I'm going to guess it rhymes with step, something, something. To give your old sneakers a little more pep and put a new science Y spring in your step. See, look at that. In your step. Good job if you guys guessed that too. Good, good, good. <clears throat> I'm having fun here with this Dr. Seuss book. If I ran your school, we would play a fun song while I waved this wood wand and all, and you all played along. The drummers and fluters and tuba to tutors and all of the players with sliding trombones and three nozzled bluesers and saxophones would take their tune makers and turn them around and play them all backward just think of the sound. If I ran your school, we would have smell and tell. Smell and tell, that's interesting. Where you bring in a thing and that thing has a smell. That was a good smell all the time. We would smell that thing well as you stand up and tell how the thing that you bring got its good or bad smell. If I ran your school, I would sit in the bleachers and cheer you all on right along with your teachers. Through round after round after round after round, a school of hoop hoopla to see who gets crowned. As the hoopla hoop queen and the hoopla hoop king, the new queen and king of all school a hooping. <laughs> I love it. If I ran your school at your very last class, you all would be getting a go wild pass. Your classes are over, your school day is done, and now it is time for some fun in the sun. <laughs> I'm loving it. Then all of my little cat crew would be there to welcome you all to their little cat fair. The games and the rides and the loop the loop slides and the extra fun prizes that come in all sizes should keep you all smiling the whole school year through. If I ran your school, that is what I would do. Then tip my top hat and say farewell to you there may be more schools that will need me, you see, 
to show them how fun that their school day can be. Oh. Do you think that your school needs a visit from me? <laughs> The end. Aw. The end, you guys. I had so much fun reading this. And look at the back. <laughs> Looks like lined paper. Loose leaf paper. Wow. That was the end. Thank you, thank you, thank you so much for being here and listening to me read fun and exciting books like this on this fun day Monday. Thank you, thank you, thank you. And I'll see you again tomorrow, won't I? Shout out to my mom who's always here. Yes, shout out to my girl Victoria. She shares my videos all the time. She shares them all the time. Thank you, thank you, thank you, and extra thank you. Thank you to all of you, and extra thank you to all of you who share my videos. Y'all, yeah. share my videos. And thank you all to those who go to YouTube, look for Audrey's Reading Area, and you smash that subscribe button for me. Smash that subscribe button. Smash it up, smash it up, everybody smash it up. All right, all right, all right, you guys. I am over and out, and I will see you again tomorrow live. L-I-V-E at 5. Live at 5. See you tomorrow here at Audrey's Reading Area. Audrey's Reading Area.